Hey, welcome back. This is just a quick video on how to remove the taillights on a Hyundai Santa Fe. This Santa Fe in particular is a 2019, but for the most part, they're all uh, almost identical. So the first thing we got to do is uh, open up these two caps right here. As you can see, there's a tiny little slot there on each of them. And you just put a screwdriver in and you just pry it open like so. And they're hinged. And then once you get that open, they're just, uh, there's just two Phillips screws holding it in on the back. So we're just using a number two Phillips. There's one. And there's two, so that's all the hardware holding them on. Reason I'm pulling these tail lights out is because I'm spraying oil for undercoating and I like to make sure I get all up inside the rear quarter panel and this is the easiest way to uh, gain a little extra access. So the next step, we need to push the tail light back. I find the easiest way is to uh, kind of do a glancing blow like that. That's uh, secure and firm if they're really uh, stiff. The first time getting these out, I struggled for a while to get them out. But once I got it out once, they come in and out a lot easier. So I usually just put a little bit of pressure like so, and then do a little, just like that. And it just slides right back. And then we have one electrical connector on here. So right there's our electrical connector. And we just gotta pop that off and the light's fully free from the vehicle. So we just squeeze it down with our hand, give it a little bit of a jiggle. And now our light's fully free. So right here is where those two screws were on the back of it. And then you have two locating pins right here. And then you have a, a slotted spot right here for the light to slide into to keep it from flopping on the back end of it or the front, depending how you want to refer to it. So this is the electrical connector. I just squeeze down on that when I pull it out. Those are the uh, two spots for that locate, those locating pins go in. And then right here is where the uh, slotted part goes on the back of the light or the front. And if you're referring to the front of the vehicle, I call it the back of the light. I don't know, same thing. But that's what keeps that in there. And then sometimes when you pull the light out, this uh, rubber grommet pops out. You just have to, uh, Slip it back in like so before you put the light back in so you're good. So, but I'm actually going to uh, pop that grommet back out and uh, I'm also going to pop this off because it gives me more access for oil spraying. But if you're just changing a light bulb or whatever, you don't need to uh, pop those out. And now to put it back in, it's going to be the uh, same thing but reverse. So when we go to put it back in, the first thing we're going to do is re-plug in the electrical connector. And if you have some dielectric grease, it's never a bad idea to put some dielectric grease on it. And then the next thing we're going to do, we're going to keep it tight to the body. We're going to feel for those locator pins. And then we just push it in. And it's uh, fitting secure all the way around. And now our last step is just to uh, put the screws back in. And it definitely goes back in easier than it came out, I find. They, they just get in there for a while with the uh, expansion and contraction from the sunlight and the cold and everything. They just kind of seem to uh, stick together a little bit better. But we put our uh, screws back in for the lights. They don't need to be crazy tight or anything. Close those up. And we are all done. So as you can see, it's fitting all the way back in the way it was. Everything looks good. That's all closed up. Everything's nice and tight. All right, so that's all that's involved in removing the tail light. It's the exact same on uh, both sides. Just those two screws. Push it back, remove the connector if you need to, if you're pulling the light right out. If you're just changing the bulb, you could do it with the uh, light still plugged in. If it, but it might be easier to unplug it. 
Thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe and click the notification button. Have a great day.